Well, the curtain will rise soon on a very popular musical in downtown Buffalo. Finding Neverland has taken Broadway by storm and will now take the stage at Shea's Performing Arts Center. The musical was inspired by the book about Peter Pan. News 4's Marissa Perlin takes us behind the scenes as crews set up. The Broadway hit Finding Neverland is launching its first ever national tour and it picked Buffalo as its first stop. There will be 10 shows put on here at Shea's and to put on a show this size, well, it takes a lot of moving parts. The first night is always like, you know, pins and needles for everybody. And there's a lot to do at Shea's before opening night. Orchard Park native Jason Yunker runs the production side of this national tour. He says cast and crew have been working on this for a year and a half. But physically bringing it to Buffalo comes with some challenges. Once the tours are up and running, everything is a, a finely tuned machine. But right now, it's the first time that the lighting people are meeting the set people and are meeting the audio people. And the designers are in the building. And just getting them all to come together on the same page and bring it together is probably the most challenging. 14 people travel with the crew and almost 60 locals are picked up in each city to help run the show. At each stop, they have just 16 hours to make the show happen. They'll pick key elements and adapt to different stages at each stop. This tour is going to be seen all over the country. We're taking it to Japan next summer. You know, so something that is created here by the people from Buffalo with us. Um, you know, I think it's exciting to kind of push that out there. For prospective theater students, getting to see this behind the scenes magic happen is quite the learning experience. This has never happened at Shays before. So to be able to like get more details about it, like, oh, it, I would have never known that loading in and loading out takes longer the first time and there's just so many different elements that I got to learn about. Buffalo is starting to develop as a musical community and I really think that it's wonderful for a lot of kids that love musical theater. And for Yunker, on opening night, seeing it all come together never gets old. I've been doing this for about 20 years and uh, it's still magical every time. From here in Buffalo, the cast and crew will head to Pittsburgh and then Rochester. The show opens on October 7th. If you'd like more ticket information, head to this story on the Founded on Force section of our website, WIVB.com. Reporting in downtown Buffalo, Marissa Perlman, News 4. We're so fortunate now that we have a theater like Shays that can handle these yes, big the capacity, Broadway yeah. produ productions. Didn't used to have that, so that's great.